one tool that is really helpful for you and for your students to save time in class is uh, QR codes. Uh, these are, they're called quick response codes and very simply they are uh, labels that students can scan with an app on their device that will take them directly to a website that you want them to use. So uh, in one of our other videos uh, we made a room to uh, talk about ancient Egypt on today's meet and if I want my students to use this in class then uh, I need to give them access to this as soon as I can so that they don't have to spend time typing in this whole link. So instead of doing that, I can just go to this website, qrstuff.com, and I can let this create a QR code that my kids can then use in class. So once I'm on my website, I need to also have the website that I want my kids to use. Uh, I'm going to copy this link. So this is all highlighted. I'm going to copy, go back to my QR code generator tab, and then I'm going to click in this website URL box and we'll paste. You'll notice that the QR code has changed. This is good. It means that uh, it's registered what website this is and it's created a code that goes with this link. And then all I have to do now is click download QR code. Once that's done, uh, my QR code is here, and I have a very simple image uh, that is now the code that my kids can use. I normally like to give this a name. I might call this, you know, Ancient Egypt, oops, <laughs> uh, Ancient Egypt Today's Meet. Something that'll help me remember, oh, that's what this is, that's what this picture's for. And then uh, you can post it anywhere. It's, it's an image. You can put it on a Word document. You can put it on your PowerPoint if you want kids to see it on the smart board. Uh, you can print it off and post it somewhere in your room for kids to go and scan. Uh, the possibilities are, are, are varied. There's a lot of options. But uh, this will save your kids a lot of time uh, in terms of getting to the websites they need to get to right away. So that uh, is how you use the QR code generator.